Olá meus olhos, meus espectadores, começando mais um vídeo aqui do canal e pessoal vamos continuar aqui, vamos para mais um gameplay aqui de Alan Wake, vamos lá, vamos continuar então, a gente parou aqui agora no... Back here, sweetie. How was it? Worst weather I've ever seen. You should put some coffee on, it'll warm you up. Uh, na segunda agora, né? Começando a segunda, segundo episódio, sendo que o primeiro eu não entendi nada. Por quê? O que, que acontece? Como vocês podem ver que ela tá agora junto com ele, a esposa dele, né? Só que no primeiro momento, né? Ele tem uma, ele tá dirigindo ali, aí de repente ele se dá conta que ele tá na floresta, daí tem que ir lá no farol lá e encarando criaturas esquisitas, depois ele do nada ele acorda e ele tá numa viagem, a mulher dele tá dirigindo, até aí tudo bem, aí depois os dois, né, tão ali, Coffee's on. Great, thanks. I'll need it if I'm gonna finish... encontrou a cabana no meio da floresta, aí do nada ela some, e daí ele tenta procurar ela, né? Foi parar lá no posto de gasolina, daí lá no posto de gasolina encontrou uma policial e daí do nada acabou o capítulo. E agora volta aqui no capítulo de novo e ele tá já na casa ali pelo jeito, na casa dele e na companhia dela. Foi isso que aconteceu, que eu entendi até agora, quer dizer, eu não entendi nada. <risos> não entendi nada, nada, nada. Vamos lá, vamos continuando jogando aqui, né? Ah, tá, eu tenho que ir lá junto com ela agora. Tá aqui. Oh, hey, I just finished those cover mock-ups. They're on your desk. Tell me what you think. No kidding. I didn't think you'd get them done this quickly. On occasion, I can perform all sorts of miracles, my dear. Oh, really? Well, you seem to think so last night. Vamos lá, deixa eu ver qual que é a próxima coisa que a gente tem que fazer. Bonita casa, hein? Olha, tá aberto aqui. Um rádio ali, neve lá fora. The continuing freezing rain and heavy snowfall have necessitated a winter storm warning in the entire tri-state area. People are advised to stay indoors as many... Eu até agora não entendi aquele mapa ali ainda. Sinceramente, não entendi aquele mapa ali. Ah, tem um... O que, que é um banheiro aqui? É, um banheiro. Banheira. Vamos ver. Ah, tem outra porta aqui, ó. Eu entrei por aqui. Será que eu entrei por aqui? Vamos ver. These look really good. Oh, sure, until Barry gets his hands on them. Which, by the way, will happen over my dead body. The last time was the last time. Oh, and speaking of Barry, he called. <gasps> Alan! Alan, please check the fuse box. 
I'm right here. I'm on it, honey. Please hurry. Is that me now? Close the door. I really don't like this, Alan. Please hurry. I'm right here, baby. I'm fine. I'm fine. Just get the lights back on now, please. Ah, então é aqui. Honey, it's a power outage. I I've got the flashlight. Okay. Aqui, aqui que ela tá. Já tô perdido aqui. E rapaz, já começou com esse negócio de. Ah, ela tá lá. Hi. You okay? I'm sorry. I just. It just really spooked me. Don't worry. We'll just break out the candles. I know it's stupid, but it's just. Especially when I'm not prepared for it, you know? It gets to me. I love you. Tell me a story, Ryder. Okay. <clears throat> I used to have these nightmares when I was a kid. The dark really spooked me, too. When it got really bad, my mom gave me this old light switch. She called it the clicker. The clicker, huh? Yeah. If I ever got scared of the dark, I could just flip the switch and a magic light would scare the monsters away. Oh, sure. Here it is. Alan. Maybe it'll help you too. <laughs> yeah, nice story, writer boy. You made that up right now, didn't you? No, no. <laughs> Seriously. I love you, even if you are a liar. Thanks for this. Eita nós. How do you feel, Mr. Wick? Any nausea, disorientation, anything like that? Mr. Wick, how are you feeling? I'm okay. My head's fine. I had to lie about my headache and memory loss. He'd send me to a hospital for tests. I couldn't leave without Alice. Mm, very well. Um, I don't think you have a concussion, but you've obviously been through quite a shock. You should take it easy for a couple of days. Thanks. Then, Mr. Wake, we're done here. If the pain gets any worse or you experience any other symptoms, you should come see me. I'll let you get on with it then. Sarah, uh, Sheriff Breaker, is waiting for you. She's very good at her job. I'm sure she can locate your wife in no time. Doc Nelson was the image of a small town doctor. Sheriff Breaker had called him to the station to take a look at the cut in my head. Beleza. Uma vara de pescar um peixão aqui. I'm sorry you had to cut your morning fishing short for this, Doc. Oh, she's a beauty, ain't she? Bem comum encontrar uma vara de pescar e um peixe no consultório médico. From an old fisherman like me, but she's right up there. Now she's a largemouth bass, which is what you're after if you prefer a lure. Now if you want either trout or salmon, on the other hand, then it's fly fishing for you. Um, you a fishing man, Mr. Wake? Oh, doesn't really? Hmm? Huh? What the? What the? Thank you for testing the lights, Miss Weaver. Everything seems to be fine. I don't have the luxury of being complacent, Deputy Grant. The bulbs will need changing soon. You can't change them in the dark. I'll be sure to take care of it, Miss Weaver. Have a nice day now. Very good. I'll come back later on. Yeah, it's uh, Mulligan here. I'm at Stucky's gas station with Thornton. There's no sign of him. Over. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, this is Thornton.
Quase que eu não pego aqui, ó. Mr. Wake, the sheriff is waiting for you in her office down the corridor. Monte. That was Cynthia Weaver. I guess you can call her the town eccentric. She used to be the editor of the local newspaper, but she's focused on um well, other things these days. Opa, tá um parado aqui. Cadê a tal da Sara? Come in, Mr. Wake. Your phone's on the desk. The battery was dead. It's charged now. Your phone, Mr. Wake? Have you started looking for my wife yet? My men are already on it. Now, can you tell me what happened? I'm not sure. I can't remember. We were arguing. I walked out of the cabin. The cabin on Cauldron Lake? How did you end up at Stucky's gas station? I wanted to tell her what had happened last night, but I couldn't. She'd lock me up. Ah, rapaz. Excuse me. I need to take this. Hello? Alan, please help me. Alice? Stop talking to the law. You'll do exactly what I say if you ever want to see your wife again. Who is this? Go to the back lot. There's a hole in the fence on the left. Look inside the junker. I left a little something there to convince you we're all on the same page here. After you ditch the cops, you're gonna meet me in Elderwood National Park. There's a spot called Lover's Peak. Midnight. Don't do nothing stupid, pal. We're watching you. Tá, agora acho que agora tô começando a entender, né? Então aquela... Esse, essa cena que ele tava com ela ali pode ser uma cena do passado. Pelo jeito, né? Que agora ele voltou aqui procurar a mulher dele. Desaparecido. Eu acho que é pra cá, hein, que a gente tem que ir. Ou é pra cá. Mr. Wake, can I help you with anything? I need to get some air. The sheriff said I could go out back. Of course, Mr. Wake. You can get there through the cell corridor. The early morning light hurt my eyes and made my head ache. The man on the phone had said, go through the fence on the left. Folks, it's been another long. O rato tá tocando, tá tocando a música. Vamos lá. E agora? O cara. É, tem uma coisa brilhando lá, né? Será que eu consigo? Examinar. Será que é lixeira? Será que é lixeira? Vamos ver. É alguma coisa ali, né? Pelo jeito. E agora, como que eu vou sair daqui agora? 
Ah tá. Sei lá, mano, como é que eu vou entrar ali? Bom, só se a gente tiver e pro outro lado, né? Não sei se foi por aqui que eu vi. Ah, tem um, uma porta ali. Fechado. É, também aqui não dá acesso. Aqui o manuscrito, a gente tá numa cela aqui, né? Ei, please help me, man! I hate us! I can't stand the dark anymore! de fora na área da cela se eu sair pelo lado de fora vamos ver I couldn't go anywhere yet I had to play along with the caller Alice's life was at stake Pode sair ainda, tá? A TVzinha de tubo. Oi, moça. Are you all right, Mr. Wake? Can we continue the interview? I need to go outside. Clear my head. Well, we can talk once you're feeling better. Agora, hein? Acho que é. Será que é aqui? Bom, aqui não tem nada que a gente possa... E pra lá, né? Deixa eu ver o que tem aqui. Fechado. Ah, 
errado. Ok, aquele lugar que sai para fora, beleza. Esse aqui não. Caramba, velho. Tá perdido, hein? Não dá pra sair. E agora? Olha lá. Abriu. Mas ele não sai. Quero sair, quero sair. Voltar lá de novo aqui na. Please nice turn the lights on! Hey! Please turn the lights on! Thank you, man. Thank you. Hey, you're all right. You're a good guy. Don't let anybody tell you. Será que é ele? You know I shouldn't even be in here. The cops, they got it. All wrong. See, sure, sure, sure. I beat him up, but I... into the dark. Alice's life is at stake, but I can't think about that, or I'll lose it. The dread lingers at the edge of perception. I'll push on. Anything is possible here. I'll write the story. I'll save her. Are you feeling any better, Mr. Wake? I'd like to leave. Am I free to go? Well, we still need to talk about. Am I under arrest? No, of course not. But I need to know where you'll be staying so I can get in touch with you. I'd avoid the motel. The Majestic is known for its roaches. The cabins at Elderwood are pretty nice, though. That sounds perfect. I'm Dr. Emil Hartman. I'd like to invite you to stay at Cauldron Lake Lodge. Did you talk to my wife? I had the pleasure of discussing your situation with her on several occasions. Did you set something up with her? I invited her here. My clinic is a place where... Oh! Hey! Oh, my! Take it easy. Hey, nobody move. Get your hands off of my client. Who are you? I'm Barry Wheeler, his agent. If you have business with Mr. Wake, you talk to me. Vamos lá. Seriously, Al, what you were saying in the car... Just listen to yourself. What, you shot a guy and his body just disappeared? When was the last time you slept? What, are you high? Wait here. Easy there, boy. I'm almost done. Hey, Rusty, right? You're at cabins. Oh, Mr. Wake. I'd shake your hand, but mine are kind of full here. Actually, I'm sorry about this. Would you mind grabbing the registration form from the desk? It's just across from Bucktooth Charlie. <laughs> okay, sure. What happened? Crazy poachers. Max here got his foot caught in a trap. They're illegal to use here. Hell, you're not supposed to hunt within the park at all. But that doesn't stop some lowlifes. <sighs> well, at least Max is gonna be okay. He got lucky. <coughs> Max is still groggy from the shot I gave him, and I'd rather not leave him alone just yet. The form's on the desk across from the mammoth skeleton. Deu ruim pro cachorrinho, hein? Tá parecendo que é um okay, voo de trigo. We're almost done here. Vê se tem lugar bonito aqui pra ver. That's a good dog. Have you been drinking? No! Look, Barry, I'm missing a week, and someone's got Alice, Do and everything's just... Do you understand what it sounds like when you say stuff like that? Don't get me wrong, it's a good story, could be a bestseller. But when you start confusing fiction with reality, you're buying yourself a ticket to the funny farm. Não é por aqui não, hein? Seriously, Al, you can't just go and meet a kidnapper. Those Ouch. situations always end up in disaster. You gotta talk to the cops. She's my wife, and it's my call. Can we talk about this later? No. This whole thing... It... Listen, you hit your head. I mean, jeez, Al, come on. 
You gotta understand how crazy all this sounds. If you're trying to pull a joke on me, freak me out, it's working. Ha ha, let's have a laugh on Barry. Well, you had me going there real funny, Al. We hear it now. We have our formula out of our rusty. I think this is the form you wanted. And here are the keys. Okay, you're all set, Mr. Wake. Glad to have you staying here. Thanks. Can you tell me how to get to Lover's Peak? Oh, sure. It's at the end of the nature trail. Just follow the paths, you'll get to it eventually. It's an easy walk. Nice spot, too. If you have any trouble finding it, just keep your eyes on the radio mast. It's right below that. Oh, and hey, if you take a walk in the woods, watch your step so you don't end up like Max. I guess I'm a little worried. We got a bunch of campers out there we haven't heard from. It's not like these people are on a schedule, but with the traps, well, you know, I just don't want any trouble. Right, thanks. Beleza. Look, Al, you're asking me to believe that you shot a dude who went poof into thin air, a guy who was bulletproof until you pointed a flashlight at him. That's just crazy talk, Al. Al. Al? We should go to the sheriff or call the FBI. Damn it, Barry, they'll kill her. This is not a goddamn debate, Barry. I'm going to Lover's Peak. He said to come alone. Okay, okay then. I understand. You're my best friend. Tell me what to do to help, and I'll do it. You stay here, and if I'm not back by morning, call the cavalry. Just be careful with the natives, Al. These yokels are dangerous. Everybody hates a tourist, or it'll be deliverance all over again. Bless you. Oh, this place is trying to kill me. I'll bet there's mold in here, spores, poison ivy, God knows what. This is so not worth a 15% commission. Lock the door when I leave. Yeah, yeah, you go ahead and do what you have to do. I'll be fine. Alone, but fine. In a cabin straight from a horror movie. Real funny, Al. Real funny. Ha <laughs> ha. Thank you. I'll just sit here in the dark till you come back, or until I get eaten by a Gru. Only guys, no. Ah, estamos aqui na cabana ainda, né? Lá de fora do barco. Ou não? Não não é. Não, aqui é outro lugar já. Uma garrafa aqui. E agora não sei porque que servem essas garrafas ainda. Tem algo brilhando aqui. Ih, vai quando tem bateria e bala porque a gente vai encontrar alguma coisa no caminho, hein? Fechado. Beleza. Tá um churrasqueiro aqui. Bonito lugar. Olha, rapaz. Que da hora, hein? que não tem nada aqui, então vamos ao que interessa. Trancou a porta. Vai 
de carro ou vai de... Barry had the keys to the car he rented. It wasn't a long walk to the visitor center, and it wouldn't be any use to me in the forest. No. Não vai de carro, não vai a pé mesmo. I knew I should have gone to the cops. This wasn't the smartest thing I'd ever done, but I was still angry with Barry for trying to talk me out of it. These people had called me right in the sheriff's station. The cops wouldn't scare them, and they had Alice. Um casinha no meio do nada. Vem que centro. E rapaz, começou, hein? Começou, acho que vai dar ruim aqui. Pra caralho, é que você é doido, é? Vai. Subir dá pra ver, né? Eu vou arrepiar os cabelos do Brioco agora. Tá doido, rapaz. Quer matar de susto, cria. Back to the show, folks. As promised, our very own Dr. Nelson has just parked his rear end in the studio. Doc, what's your Deerfest plan like? My plan? You make it sound a lot more organized than I ever seek to manage. That's <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, yeah. no Really, just taking the atmosphere. I'm getting a little too rickety to do much more than that, you know. Oh, tell me about it. No sack race for us older gentlemen, huh? <laughs> yes, exactly that. But I'm going to check out the parade, of course. And I'll be one of the pie contest judges, too. <laughs> uh, well, that takes a different kind of constitution. Vamos lá, seguindo. Valeu a pena vir aqui, né? Ih, rapaz! Caralho, tinha alguém ali fora, velho. Caralho. Cadê você? Onde estás? É. Rapaz. Agora o bicho pega, hein? O bicho vai pegar! Como diz o Tijuana. Bom. Opa! Escutei algo. Escutei algo. Será que entramos aqui? Pico do Amante. Porra, rapaz. 
like to fail. Porra, apresentou que era alguém ali de baixo. Parece que é só madeira. A TV. Crime and punishment. The cancer and cure of civilization. But some crimes are impossible to punish. Especially in Night Springs. Tonight's episode. The Man in the Mirror. He's inside, Agent. He's a weird one. So, you're confessing to killing that guy, huh? Why? Is it coming? Yeah, but why would you do that? I mean, you're a nice guy. Vamos lá, acabou. Ih, rapaz. Meu do prédio. Ih, de pedras que caem Hello? Back here. I'm back here. Hey. Tá machucado. Mr. Wake? <laughs> oh, hell. It happened. Just the way it was on that page. I found. Game true. It knew. So dark. It'll come back for me. You must. The lights. In the office. I have the key. Okay, Rusty. Hang on. I'll be right back. Whatever did this couldn't be far. Rusty had found a page from the manuscript. It would help me understand what had happened. Hey, y'all. Revolver. Pô, louco, foi feio o negócio, hein? Você tá doido, hein? Ah, agora, ah, tá, agora que eu tô no lugar aqui que eu tava antes. Oh, oh gold. Good boy. Oh. Presence. Como é que é? Firma aí, Rusty. 
Aguenta firme que o papai já tá voltando. Like the forest at, at night. Woke up. It'll be back. I know it will. It hasn't finished with me yet. Pra cá, não deixou. Hum, tá uma catástrofe. The only way to make sure that Rusty was safe was to get the power running and the lights back on. Ligar as luzes. Vai ter bala aqui, quer ver? Isso mesmo. Bateria. Someone had destroyed the circuit breaker. There was no way to get the lights back on. Rusty! 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 was covered with oily patches that looked like liquid darkness. Sized 
fishing is only permitted for those prisoners who purchase a park fishing license. Obey! The park ranger's instructions. At all times. Rusty. Rusty, no! Never! Deu um trabalho, hein? Ah, tem até a bala aqui, louco. Tinha bala que escabaço, eu poderia vir aqui. Beleza. Aí checkpoint alcançado. Beleza, pessoal. Acho que vou ficando por aqui. Já estamos aí quase 50 minutos. Então, para o vídeo não ficar muito extenso, a gente continua no próximo. Vamos ficando por aqui. Até o próximo vídeo. Beijo do Neco.